During the red stage of the Litiquida training, your cat will be modifying two important behaviours. Firstly, whenever they need to do their business, they'll learn to go into the room where the toilet is. And secondly, they'll learn to hop up onto the toilet to do it. Place the Litiquida on the floor next to the toilet. Insert the red training disc and fill with four to five cups of litter. Then show your cat their new litter tray. Put him or her into it so they feel it's got litter in it like they're used to. Try to do this around the times they usually go to the toilet. Pretty soon they'll get the idea. Also, ensure the door to the toilet is always left open so your cat can get in. If they can't get in, they'll have to go somewhere else and you don't need me to tell you where that might be. Keep showing them where the litter quitter is for a few days. It should only take two to three days to get used to this and then they'll regularly go to this room to use it. At night, you could try keeping them in this room to help them become adjusted to using their tray here. Once they've been using the litter quitter comfortably like this for at least a week or so, you can move on to the second part of the red stage, getting your cat to hop up onto the toilet. Getting your cat to hop up onto the toilet is easier than it sounds. Raise the seat and lid on the toilet. Slip the litter quitter on top of the porcelain bowl and push down to fit securely. The litter quitter is designed for all standard toilet bowls and has removable spring clips to ensure a snug fit. Insert the red training disc and fill with litter as before. Then show your cat where the litter quitter is just like before. Put them on it so they understand that it's moved. Again, try to be there when they first go looking for it to make sure they know where it is. Your cat should have no trouble hopping up onto the toilet bowl as cats are naturally nimble creatures. However, if your cat is still young or unusually small, you can place a small step, made from books for example, next to the toilet to help them jump up. You'll be surprised just how quickly they get the hang of this. Cats like to toilet in an area where they have privacy and feel secure. It's worth spending time at this stage making sure your cat is comfortable in his toileting environment, especially if he's not previously toileted in the bathroom. Take him there after meal times, when he wakes up or after a play session. These are times that cats often need to toilet, so you're more likely to have success. Praise her if she does the right thing and try and ignore any mistakes. All learners make mistakes. Once your cat has been going to the room where the toilet is and confidently hopping up to use it for a couple of weeks, it's time to move them on to the amber stage. Don't rush through this stage as this might make your next stage more difficult. Yeah.